Hello everyone, let me wish you a joyful day. Today we have arrived to a very special recording. In total we produced already 100 podcasts so far and we have received a lot of interesting and valuable sharings from Leslie King's. His explanations and stories not only based on what he believes in but on what he has experienced in real life as well. I believe, Leslie, that your answers and stories have triggered many more questions in our listeners' mind, just like I have sometimes more questions after I listened to you. Now, as we uh, we move uh, further, and uh, this uh, 100 uh, podcast will be uh, concluded, we wrap, wrap it up and let's call it volume one. Uh, in the future, you will find all the 100 uh, recordings in one playlist. And then it will be very interesting for our subscribers uh, and listeners to see that um, this playlist will start with the 100th one. And uh, the last podcast on this list will be the first recording. So it's interesting, isn't it? And somehow this triggers uh, our question for the 100th recording. And the question is, what does it really mean that the last will be the first and the first will be the last? The question is, look like it's very simple and people reading the Bible and they said, yeah, but Many who are first will be last, and many who are last will be first, like Matthew chapter 19 and verse 30 says. Yes, but uh, if you really want to study these wonderful Bible verses, it's hidden a very deep secret of the kingdom. But let's just see something and story in my life. I am so blessed. I had a wonderful place in Discovery Bay in Hong Kong and most of the most of beautifulest place, I think so. And uh, my home's view was uh, to the um, to the sea and uh, very good air and uh, very peaceful really and fantastic uh, ministry what i lead here in hong kong basically ministries we have five companies uh, and also philippines two companies some is church some is some other things I was well-known piano teacher, and worship teacher, and uh, we are connected in Hong Kong, uh, more than 7,000 people, and also got to mission to five different continents. It was really a wonderful time. But one day I said to the Lord, uh, Lord, I have also a wonderful family. My wife don't need to work. My son have everything, good school. And one thing's missing in my life. Teach me about your grace. No, please be very careful what you pray. <laughs> For a grace word is somehow some of the Bible verses connected about when you really go to a very deep, difficult time. And this time the grace is increasing. You can study, you can find the Bible. So the Lord basically totally get everything from me. We be homeless. You can close also the church, uh, the ministry, and uh, very interested. They come my heart operation, that means uh, health problems, 
So a little bit, how to say, um, I maybe felt like Job in the Bible, but Job's life was really terrible. But I live, my life was so in grace. I was so happy for learning about, about the people, love the people, love the street people, the homeless people, the poor people, and uh, everything be just so simple. Some of you maybe cannot understand that it was always cursed and God is just making these things for you, for uh, you had a lot of things in your life that is not clear and we don't understand and you can just see this is the answer from God. You can have many judgments in any way, but absolutely changed my life in the last five years. And most to share, my relationship with God is under this f five years is more in the last 40 years what I learned. I basically saved in 82 years, 50 years ago. So, and praise the Lord for today also. The Lord make many miracles in my health and also I receive food of what I need daily. We try no, we do, by God's grace and some brothers and sisters' prayer and also financial support. I also can live from day to day and have some social help also. Of course, I bankrupt also. It's a very difficult time. The most have finished the bankrupt this year. So many interesting things happened and I was absolutely turn to his hand in the grace of God. Now let's see something about uh, in other Bible verses. Mark chapter 9 and verse 35. Sitting down, Jesus called at 12 and said, Anyone who wants to be first must be the very last and the servant of all. At this time I don't understand these Bible verses. Servant of all is nearly 8 billion people. Be last, I don't understand. But today, when I do this podcast and seeing for nearly 9,000 people uh, interested for this YouTube channel and also joyfully many people encourage for uh, teach about how to um, learn and how to uh, compose scripture songs and how to improvise by the Holy Spirit. So a lot of things in my heart, what to do, and just bearing the fruits and living by grace. And one day when I need to go back to God, means I just can leave all things, what he did through my life. And the songs can continue still here, the teaching continues still here. I believe the impact will be good. And I hope also people when they understand if God allowed to them for not just to forgive for many people just hurt, even disappointed about the things what may expected or cannot connect it to the Bible, but no problem. For it's help for me for make a big changes. And yes, I did many wrong. What I don't recognize five or six years ago, but today I see some point for oops, oh no, I understand. I often share for I think so it can be good a book about these things also. 
but means my family, my wife, my sons know more about it. And this is give more something connected and keep going. Not easy, but we keep going, serve God. But look at this, must be the very last. No, I think so. I might be uh, one of the very last. <laughs> and through internet, servant, servant of God, servant of Jesus for all. I can see something developing in this way in my life. But the message today be more interest, more interesting. For if you look at the Holy Spirit character, is a wave form, like the Holy Spirit, like water. Not this is really a wave form. The Holy Spirit also like wind, and also is a wave form. And Holy Spirit character also for fire also a wave form, and speak the word of God is also wave form. And the music also wave form. And if you learned, and I'm sure you knowing, that every wave is up, side, down, up, side, down. For go to a Mountain, we go from the valley up to the mountain. And if you want to go to a higher mountain, we must may go down to the valley and after go up to the mountain. But maybe we can sweating and not easy, but finally we can see new things, we can learn many things. So be encouraged about your life to these Bible verses for f but many who are first will be the last and many who are last will be a first is wonderful be accept in your life and come the down period is not something a negative judgment a curse but for you from then go up 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 to the mountain so I like to encourage you for whenever you go, if you are top mountain, don't be discouraged if you cannot hold and the Lord calling to another mountain. And you see the other, oh, what is it? This is a Mount Everest. I like to go this mountain, higher and higher. The peoples have always had also for going higher place. Jesus go also to the mountain for praying. So we have a lot of secrets about these wonderful Bible verses and these wonderful questions. So God bless you. And if you are on the mountain, be ready for have my a taller mountain, but you must go down to the valley. And if you're valley and you can see nothing and darkness look like is not something cursed in your life. Just keep going for step by step. You can go up and up and up and up, up the top. And you see once again, much new view of God's creation direction for your life. Thanks for watching the Leslie King's podcast. I really appreciate you. Another way to show support is through YouTube memberships. And if you do, there are royalty budgets and other perks depending on your level of membership. All you need to do is click the join button underneath the video to find out. Thank you for your support.